I also haven't really practiced today, so we'll see how that goes. And that happens with the Xbox 360. Wow, great. I saw Vern fall down, which may mean I don't get to skip. I got it. Okay. Great music in this level. Said, oh well. Boy, hey, I was gonna check if there's a lot of things I was supposed to do before I started a full run. Oh well. I'm, I mean, like the run's gonna be fine, but I was gonna check for skips in a couple levels. At least, yeah. Anyway, whatever. I'll do IL runs throughout the week anyway. I think full runs I should reserve to the weekend. I should leave that to the weekend, the artist. I'm just quitting and I'm gonna let the weekend do it. Here we go. No. Uh, stupid joke. Wasn't even really a good joke. Whatever. Um, I don't know. I'm really tired today. I took a nap for like three hours instead of streaming, which I was supposed to do at three. It's literally the only time I have on the schedule is at 3 p.m. on Sundays, and I failed to do even that, so. You get a stream at eight o'clock at night because I accidentally took a nap. I didn't even mean to take a nap, I just ended up taking a nap for like three and a half hours. Thankfully, I didn't have anything, like, super important to do today, other than this, so that was good, but I just, like, fell asleep, and it was... It's the first time I've ever done that, and it scared me. Because I woke up, and I'm like, what happened? Ooh, this is not great. Oh, well. Where did I lose all my time again? I honestly kind of forgot. I remember my, uh, what was it? The c cave interiors was really good. I remember that. And I got, like, all the skips that I was supposed to. So that was important. How did. What? what Apparently I reset on Cotton Hedge at one point. I don't even know how that works. But yeah, now I'm kind of like over the splits, which is kind of cool. That little stick man. On top of the splits. But I think I have like two minutes of like time loss from just bad oh mountain paths that's what it was that was a huge time loss area but I don't know what I can because I didn't I was supposed to practice that but like I said I fell asleep uh, at like one 
and I was supposed to go live at 3, but when I woke up... Okay, no, I went to sleep at like 2, and then I woke up at like 5. So I was supposed to stream at 3, but that didn't happen. Because I was asleep, which... yeah. So I, I was supposed to practice mountain paths. That was my plan at 2. So I was going to practice Mountain Pass. I completely forgot about that. Oh well. And I missed this. Literally the one thing I'm supposed to do in this level. And I missed that up. Literally just don't jump there. That's That was the one thing and I failed doing that. Well, night streets. Oh, I have 20 seconds time to save here. All right. This is a hard level, though. So, I don't think I will be saving time because I haven't practiced it. It's the first time I have to. Oh, yeah. Uh, Martin 1 is when I need to use the dance mat. In the meantime, though, I'm just going to stand in front of it. Ah! That wasn't super bad, but it wasn't super great either. I forget there's a cutscene there. Dun, dun. I should try and glitch hunt, skip strat hunt for this level. Because it needs it. Well, I guess it doesn't need it. I would like it. That and cave interiors would be nice to have a skip for. I haven't been skip hunting, I've been doing full runs. Which is maybe not the best idea. That's not X. Maybe I lose more time on these than I think I do. Because I don't really like watch the clock on those. So I could be losing a ton of time just on those little stupid minigames. Like I don't even think of that as like a spot where I can lose time, which is maybe not the best mindset. Alright. <laughs> We're doing all right. It's weird, you can really hear that L trigger. Maybe I shouldn't have my mic feedback to me. I wonder if that's distracting to myself. But then I know if my audio is all right, so I don't know. Was it trying to press, make me press X on? Is there like something over there? I don't know why I did that. Please tell me at least get like a smidgen of time soon. Yay! 14 seconds. Okay, projector heist. I have some time save here, but I probably won't get it. 
This run is going great so far, which probably isn't a good sign, because that means I'll mess out on something later, but... Whatever. That's probably the only objective skip that's worth doing in that level. Because it's fairly easy to do, and I don't think it loses any time. Electric- I'm still, like, back and forth on electrocution. Because, like, I don't know if there's a faster way to do it. But I think as is, it's not a great idea to try and skip that objective by getting electrocuted, because it takes a while. Do I or don't? Uh, I think I'll do it. I'm not sure this is the best idea because then I have to exit to player mode here. Oh, I already did. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Yes, I knew I already exited two point one. Alright, that should have some time save, I think. lot more than oh okay yeah woods I was like that seems like a lot of time save but yes woods still pretty decent oh Martin Wong everyone's favorite okay so we use the dance pad and projector heist <laughs> now <laughs> apparently uh yeah I I like I knew that was a thing but I just decided to wing it and try it because I did it differently before and not like that, so that was kind of a risk, but right, it's definitely worth it, I think. I uh, can't hit this guy. I should have. Wait, no, finishing moves don't exist yet. Alright, this is garbage run, but whatever. That was not. Oh! Okay. That was not great movement at all. That was bad movement, I would say. Ooh, this is really not great movement. Alright, well, I need to practice this level, like, a lot, apparently. Probably better than PB, but it's not great at all. No, it's worse than PB. Yeah. I forgot how to do Because the cutscene takes forever, I forget. So this is w much worse than PB, actually, I think. slightly better. My bad. Okay, this is the hard level. Oh, 
when I say hard, it's just the first level with the two player skip. So it can be annoying sometimes. Good. Kinda saved it. Still not great. That's what it's supposed to do, but I did it a little bit. <laughs> okay, I'm distracted. So, what happened there was I didn't go enough over. Uh, up, sorry, not over. I didn't go far enough up was the problem. So, now we're like 10 seconds behind, I think. Well, not like overall. 10 seconds behind on the split, I think? 10 or 15, I don't know. But, uh, I was just not in the right area, which is why those skips can be annoying sometimes. Okay. No! That's alright. So, we're like... Behind by a bit. A couple seconds. Or... At least ten. Alright. Yeah, it's a... A Jackie the Jackie. Yeah, it's a... One of my childhood games, so reason I started speedrunning it. Been able to make quite a quite a bit of progress on the world record, which is nice. to break the 130 the barrier. That's the plan. It's what I'm going for. Yeah, well, it's 35 levels. So it's a... It used to be like 148, I think, was the world record when I started. Or 149. So, brought it down. Yeah, brought it down by a little bit. I've been trying to glitch hunt quite a bit to get it further down, but it's a hard hard one to do because it's very linear. There isn't a lot of like things that you can do to f skip levels entirely. doing this level too great. Really, I saved time. I'm surprised. Oh yeah, I didn't do great on that last time. Also, like, sections like these are probably what makes the game as long as they are. Because they're just, like, huge escort levels that you can't really do anything with. At least that I know of. I'm sure we'll find something eventually that makes them faster, but right now, you just kind of have to escort Ozzy to the end. And there's not a whole lot you can do about it. And that's why the game is as long as it is. This and this next level, actually, I think are 10 minutes of escort, basically.
Great movement. I won't. Ozzy, come on, buddy. You're still on the clock. Well, now that's not how many times in a row your teacher said you tripped and fell into the classroom aquarium. Oh, Jimmy, you have to Another huge problem of this uh, game is there's a lot of these un unskippable cutscenes which take a lot of time. And there's not a whole lot you can do about it. Just kind of adds up. but I enjoyed the game. It's better than when I was speedrunning before this, which is like a garbage DS game. I used to run Cory in the house and that was a killer on everything. Uh, the, like Because of how bad the DS uh, D-pad was, I just killed my thumb. To this day, I still like doesn't quite I can't use the d-pad anymore because of that game it was sad I had to quit that so it's kind of nice to speed run a 3d game versus that as a 2d game before where a lot of the skips are a little bit you can speed up the game a lot more I forgot about this section I think there's a little bit of time loss here. But I mean, I mean, compared to certain games, it's not too bad. Hour 30 is like pretty mid, I'd say. Yeah, it's a, it's a nice, it, there's a lot more variety to it, but I like it. 2D games are a lot easier to consistently get stuff working. 3D is a little bit harder. Having consistent movement with 3D games is much more difficult. Oh, excuse me. Much more difficult. But it seems like 3D games are so you can have bigger skips because there's just so much going on with a 3D game. So like, you can go out of bounds and stuff. Which, that's what I like. It's nice when you can skip stuff like that. Because I think the like second to last final level used to take like 11 minutes. And now it takes like two, which is nice on this game. Man, I'm bad at talking right now. Okay, um, yeah. It's just nice to have those kind of out of bounds skips that save a ton of time. I feel like you don't see that much in 2D games. At least the ones I've speed 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 run Sp speed ran speed ran no, that's not speed ran okay speed ran that's previous past tense I don't know that seems confusing 
Sped ran. Yeah, I have. <laughs> yeah, I have that problem with speedruns. I just it's hard to talk and play a game at the same time, but I wanna get better at it. The uh, out of bounds stuff uh, that I've found at least is very dependent on like camera position. So like where it's super limited where the camera can go, like in this level, it's hard to get that out of bounds clip because basically how it works is the second player has to be off screen and then because the game doesn't know where to put them, it just teleports it to the first player. So then if the first player is in the air, then the second player just like sits in the air and that's how I've been able to go out of bounds in a lot of levels but in like levels like this it's not yeah oh really yeah I also haven't run like a ton of 2d games but Uh, in Cory in the house, one person was saying that they had gotten out of bounds, but I never, never was able to recreate it, sadly. But. Yeah, that's kind of... Okay. Kind of what I was referring to, actually. Probably quite different, the setup, but... game I had that that was the case and uh, nobody knew the setup yet which was annoying but this game has quite an easy out of bounds you just kind of press a on the second controller after putting the players in the right locations which isn't too hard the hardest part is probably just getting it in a run at least for me, right now. I'm sure as world record progresses, it won't be just that. But, like... I think... Unfortunately, before I started playing this game, nobody knew about it, so... Kinda just... Being at the top for a while, but... I'm sure after a small amount of time will be... It won't be the case. Because I'm not, like, super good at the game. <laughs> A lot of people are a little bit better than me, but they haven't come back yet, so once they do, though, I'm sure this will not be the case where I'm at the top of the leaderboard. Oh, what? Oh, okay, I didn't press A. There we go. This is probably the most weird-looking one of the two-player skips. All the enemies have to be dead as well, that's... Because if the second player moves at all, then it like messes with it. Alright. Oh. Oh. This is not going too good. Why does that keep happening? That shouldn't be happening. Alright, I'm gonna do this. 
Okay, that was... That was unfortunate. A little bit of time lost there. But that's the kind of fun out-of-bounds stuff that is new to the game and saves like, in this case, like two minutes. But other levels it saves like ten, which is crazy. But you can't do that on like every level, which is... Well, as far as I know, you can't do that on every level. The running sections like this, I haven't been able to find anything for. You just kind of have to sit through them, which is annoying. I don't like that part of the game. Because it's basically just an auto-scroller, but 3D-ish. 3D-ish, I guess. It's not, like, fully... It's basically 2D, but... 3D graphics. I don't want that hat. The only thing you can do to save time in these levels is just not get the objectives. Like, in this case, it's survive with more than 80% of your health, so you have to intentionally take damage at the end of the level, just so then you're not at 80% of health. <laughs> don't have to take that much damage, but... So, now it's just one objective that appears on the screen, and that's time save. <laughs> Which is great. I love auto scrollers. All right, Smith one. This one is another two-player skip, which then I have to stand next to my wonderful dance mat. Wow! For only twenty dollars, you can have this wonderful dance mat. I'm just kidding. It's mine. You can have it. All right. This is what I use for the two-player skips because it's a lot easier than having a controller underneath my foot. Which is what I used to do, which works just fine, but I like to have a thing that's actually designed for your foot. It's much easier to use. It's not any easier to get the skips with, but... I just was getting, like, foot cramps from holding a controller underneath my foot, so... Then I bought this... <laughs> really? I'm surprised. I guess that, I mean, you know. I'm, I started speedrunning with a game that was like an hour long, so I was maybe a little bit more used to it, but. I can see the appeal of a shorter run. I just kind of like the longer runs for some reason. But I used to run like 16 star and stuff, and. It's kind of nice to have a shorter run, but I just, I end up resetting way too much, and then it hurts my head. Yeah, that's, that's a good, you know, it's a good starting point. I could never do like a 100% run of certain games, that would, I mean like, Breath of the Wild 100% I would never, I mean like, that's like a what, 30 hour run? I would never be able to have the stamina for that. Alright, this should be some time saved because it felt pretty decent. Yeah, 10 seconds. Nice. Alright, Smith's 2. Heather, cell phones and signal. Find some... I mean, maybe this one will eventually be down to like a 40 minute run, but... Ah. That's a game I've never played. It's fun though. It's one of those I've heard of, but I haven't had the time to play. Or the console. I think that's a PlayStation 3 game? I don't I don't remember. I haven't owned a PlayStation. So. Or an Xbox. I should probably not just play Nintendo games now that I think about it. But, eh. Who needs variety when you have uh Just Nintendo, apparently, which 
seems like a very bad mindset, but it's also the only thing I've ever played. <laughs> I'm sure Xbox has some great games, though. Or PlayStation. I have an original PlayStation, but... That's it. Like, I have, like, one game for it, though. It's, like, Scooby-Doo. Cyber Chase. I should do a run of that. That'd be fun. I don't have a capture card for it, though. Alright, this is the really cool one. Well, not super cool, but... It's pretty... It's... It's alright. It's... Eh... I'm bad at it, though, apparently. Alright. And then we fall out of the map. Yes! I got the fast skip, too. Alright. We're going pretty good, then. That used to be, like, a three-minute level. But you can just skip to the end of the end of the level in the first room, which is awesome. Yeah. Capture cards are expensive, man. I I went back and forth and buying one for a while, but I was like, I really want to speedrun some GameCube and Wii games, so... But I mean, they're most. If you're running a retro console, they like. I mean, they're like more expensive than that console most of the time. So it's. It's really annoying. Because I bought an HDMI capture card because I thought it was gonna look better. I think it does, but. I have a. I have to, like. Upscale the. Or. What is it? Or you do analog to digital. I'd have to do that for my original PlayStation. Which probably wouldn't look too good. Unless I did like a mod for it. But I don't have the skill for that. Ah, emulator. I suppose, yeah. Emulator is good for most things. I think that's... Yeah. And one thing I used to do for my, like, original Nintendo DS speedruns was just point a camera at the screen, which, uh, isn't the best solution, but emulator's pretty good for most of that stuff. It's just a super different feel than the original console, unless it has an actual controller. But for, like, the Nintendo DS, that's, uh, very different. This is another wonderful section where you just wait. I don't quite get it, but man. part of the game, so. Yeah. I guess that's the only way I've sp uh, sped around Super Mario 64 as emulator. I cannot pick up this item. Alright. Yeah. I don't know. I just like running on original console for some reason. I don't really have a re like, good reason for it. I just kind of do. I don't think there's any benefit other than it just doesn't say emulator in when you finish your runs. But that's not worth 150 bucks. And also, I don't have a very good PC. Well, I have an alright PC, but I don't have, like, a good graphics card in it. Or any graphics card in it. I'm just using integrated graphics. So, like, emulating GameCube games at full FPS is not something I can do. Sadly. It's 
good enough for streaming though, but not at high quality. What are we at? 480p, I think? <laughs> Yeah, but, uh, that's how I... Well, actually, I have an adapter for my computer that I use my GameCube controller on, so if I ever have to use an emulator for whatever, like Super Mario 64, I generally use just a GameCube controller. Probably one of my favorite controllers, although it has plenty of problems. mistakes this run, which is nice. Probably shouldn't have said that. Oh well. We still have some of the harder parts left. But no major mistakes thus far, which is always good. What did I do in Smith 3 that was so good? I honestly forgot what happened in that level. Oh yeah, that's the Smith house. Yeah, okay, that's what happened. I got to the good version of the skip, that's why it was so mystery. It's crazy how quickly I forget some stuff. They're still... Oh, wow! <laughs> what? Where's it going? Alright. Whatever. Let's see. Time loss? Probably not. I think that's time saved, if anything. I know there's woods after, so... I don't know. Still time save over PB, though, which is good. But not like a gold or anything, I don't think. Unless that's a 6 instead of a 9, but I think that's a 6. Yeah. Well, we're a minute ahead, which is good. Hey, well. Now this is the section where we'll probably lose a lot of time, sadly. Because I did my best I ever have on this level, which uh, is not an easy level to get a gold on because of, uh, it's like mostly fighting, which is super varied on how it behaves, because you have to deal with the randomness of the enemies, and also the randomness of, like, the second player. It's just, it's basically kind of random-ish. It's not super random, but it's not, not random. You know what I mean? Where, oh, that's where all the enemies went. And that's what I'm talking about. That was actually just poor timing on my part. But these armadillos are probably the most amount of time loss you can have in this level. Because if you don't get the finishing move off, then they just don't die right away. Like that! That's, hap that's what happens, and it's very annoying. That's probably a good set of time loss because I didn't do it perfectly. Oh, 
I forgot to ask Jackie, how do you find me? Just on your suggestion or that suggested? Yeah, I don't know. It's just nice to know sometimes. Ooh, I got the gun glitch. It's totally okay if you left too. I understand that. done that a couple times. That's why I added the tag. Because I figured it's just fun to see. I mean, a lot of the communities have put a lot of hard work in to speedruns and it's always fun to see what they're up to. Super good. This isn't going to be too much time loss, thankfully. It's not super good. I'm, I, I'm guessing, assuming that I don't do terribly on this next section, but... I think it'll be like a 6.30 instead of a 6.05. 6.05 is just... that'll be impossible to live up to for a while. Until I practice a lot more. I need to go for that ice guy last. You can't aim for him until he moves, which is annoying. Ah, okay. That was not great. Ah! <laughs> Alright, well. This is probably going to be more like a 640 because of some random stuff that just happened. Alright, cool. Oh no, a 650 even. That's great. Well, time loss happens. It's just kind of the way it is. Still 30 seconds ahead though.
Ooh, this isn't going too good. This section's a bit of RNG, but I've also not been playing super good. this section pretty good then. I don't think it's the best old I've done, but it's decent-ish. Oh, it's, it's over there. Oh well. Final, whatever. Could have been the final chip, but oh well. I'm surprised I did worse than my PB, but oh well. Mountain paths. This is probably the most annoying section. Another two players skip section, which will be fun, I'm sure. I just missed the dance mat entirely when I was pressing the A button. That was fun. That's, I think, kind of random. I don't know. Sometimes I don't know. Again, I think that was partially random again. Uh, I need to figure this section out a little bit better, I think, but it could be positioning entirely, but I don't think, yeah, none of this is supposed to happen, which I had it happen like this last time too, so I need to figure, uh, figure out a better positioning or something. Again, that's not supposed to happen, which it really sucks. I need to figure that's why I was saying I need to practice this section, which is probably what I should have been doing instead of a full run, but whatever. Alright. I had it down for a while and then kind of lost it. Oops. Alright. Oh. It's worth a shot. Why do you, um, so the second player, I don't know if you noticed, but I need to be able to control a second player, but I'm only one person, so I have the dance mat as a replacement of the second controller, because playing an actual controller with my foot is painful, uh, so I did that instead. I still need to practice with it though, because before I was using a second controller instead of that mat. But I messed up uh, in world record as well, so I will just not get that time save. Okay, that hasn't happened before. I don't think you're supposed to be able to fall off there. You're supposed to fall off on a lot of this section, but I think there's an invisible wall there normally. Yeah, I have the dance mat because uh, that's how I do those two-player skips. And 
though, so... That's just a thing right there. Alright. <laughs> Let's see. I... Oh, I can still, like, be on par with world record, I think. Again, I should have should have had time save here, but it didn't happen, which is fine. Oh, that's not the right button. Now I don't know if I do have time save. I don't have time save. It's gonna be a little bit of time loss, I think. But I messed this up before, and I'll probably will again if I don't practice. It's very important. Practice is very important. That should have been like a minute of time save, but instead I lost time. We're still ahead, which is crazy. I didn't think I would be. Huh. That was odd. It is now refusing to do a tornado attack. Great. I love when that happens. Oh well. Definitely could have been better, but... There's still a lot of levels I need to practice, unfortunately. Didn't really lose any time, that's good. This one I lost time on, I think. Has a bit of a glitch there, which is nice. I love that. That's one of the, one of those annoying sections that I can skip instead of not skip. Because otherwise, it's just an auto scroller, basically. What? I kill? Oh, it's the other one. It's like, I, I just killed that Freezy guy, but it was a different one. I had that happen last time, too. Alright, 130, 117. Okay. We'll see. Bye, save time. Save. Connor 2. Everyone's favorite. This is another fighting level, which I'm not too good at. That's one of those things when the camera changes, I just like, I'm holding the direction that I expect that I need to go in, but it's actually different because the camera changed. Ooh, okay, I'm gonna get shot at.
Ooh, that's nice. Okay, I see now. That works. I just needed to actually test it. Connor 3. I lost a lot of time on this one, I remember. That. 30 seconds, sorry. Halfway decent, I think, at least. Watch and learn the Dow of human architectural entry tactics. Should be better than PB. I don't think it's, yeah, it's definitely not a new best, but it should be better than PB at least. And then we have the escort mission. Yay! Escort mission. Woo! Yay! Escort mission. Everybody loves escort missions. Oh, wait. No. No, no. Now we have the Raid the Kitchen mission, which uh, is sometimes arguably worse. I think this one isn't too bad, but at least they're shorter than the escort missions. How long is this cutscene? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. I was just wondering if skipping it would be worth it, but I don't think it is. Because I think you probably could clip into this area before. Yeah. Yeah. You could probably clip into this area and not have to use the key, but it's a really short cutscene, so I don't know if it really matters. This cutscene is the one that you'd want to skip, but I can't think of a way to even skip it, so... I'm getting pretty unlucky today with this. Love that voice line. Never get tired of it. Best voice line in the game for sure, dude. I don't even know what a jeeper is, but... Probably don't want him cut off, I would take a guess. No! Okay. I don't... Oh, the next batch spawns. Yeah.
think I did this section decently, but the whole Pac-Man section was annoying, so who knows if I'll do good in that area. Oh, there's one right there. Cool, dude. Mini golf. Oh yeah, that's a fun one. That's probably where this run will die. If it has to die anywhere, it's probably gonna be mini golf. It's not the button I meant to press. It's my own fault, though. Wish they used Y instead of X for picking up an item. Because that's a lot easier to not mess up. At least I think so. Y, like, doesn't play a long enemy like X does, so it would be preferable if that was changed, but of course they won't. Because this is a game from 2006, so they can't really update it. So sad. I think I'm doing pretty terrible, actually, on this level. Which is crazy. I left one chip up there. Okay. Well. My bad. I lost time then. Amazing. Although I did really decently on the other section if I lost, didn't lose a ton of time. Alright, mini golf, everyone's favorite level. I'm sure. I, I think I just keep saying that. That's my uh, go to when I hate a level. Because it's a sarcastic remark. I don't think anyone loves this level. Well, not yet. Nor will they ever, probably. It's cool, but the skip is annoying to do most of the time. It's not nearly as annoying as uh, Mountain Pass. Paths? Pass? I think it's paths. Anyway. What? Okay. You better have killed that. If you didn't... Oh my goodness. Why is Vern so useless? Alright. May have actually been losing time on this area. <laughs> That's pretty decent. I don't think I've ever, like, jumped on those rats' heads before. That was kind of cool. Alright. Uh, please work game and by work I of course mean not work but in a way in which I can skip sections 
I'm gonna do one more just in case because I wasn't super confident in that one. I'm glad I did because I don't think I would have made it otherwise. Huh? Oh, that was weird. Wouldn't let me press X. I could have gotten a fast oh. fast strat, but whatever. Do 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 do. I feel like sub three is possible on this level, but I didn't get it, so whatever. Not a gold, but close enough where I'm happy with it. Uh, roller coaster tracks. This is a golded level, which does not make me happy. Ah, there's a good old disconnect. That's what you get when you watch my streams. Nothing good than a. Nothing better than a good old disconnect because of my sad internet. Wish it was my PC fault. PC's fault, honestly, so then I could at least fix it, but... Nope, it's just the internet. We're back up, though, hopefully. Always hard to tell. No! Okay, I messed up the strat. Right at the beginning. Came back. Yeah, okay, good. <clears throat> That's what happens with my internet sometimes. That's why I local locally record as well. Because I used to lose runs to that, and then I realized I could record at the same time, which uh, that saved my butt. The camera's in the wrong position, I think. That was weird. Oh, okay. I can't do that right. That's cool. Can you please hurry up, turtle? Thank you. I need to, like, figure out how to use the turtle as cannon fodder or something. So then I don't get hit there. Hopefully my... I think it, like, takes 30 seconds to come back most of the time. So. It's generally not too terrible, but... Oh. I'm doing really bad right now. <sighs> oh well. Not a gold. Time loss, unfortunately. Level's over. Hate that level. Roller coaster escape. I don't remember if there's time save there. I don't actually know where the time save is. I think I lost it already. I'm still technically ahead, but not really ahead enough. Not when I'm going for a sub 130. I'm not ahead enough. Alright. Let's do this. I still could world record, but it, I have to play well. What did I lose time on? I think I lost time on Protect the Woods, maybe? So, I could back with that. Maybe. I don't remember.
Please work camera. Please, please work. Thank you. No, that's not where it is. I forget there's this stupid section where you have to just move sideways and then occasionally press X. It's a great section. Everybody loves it. Whee! Alright! What? Oh! Uh, I'm terrible at knowing where that guy is. Alright, well, lost time. Sad. Ow! Alright, well, I'm bad at this game. Really? That's crazy. Alright. That should have been a gold, but I messed up everything at the end there. Oh well. Guess we're gonna be behind. Probably, I think. Yeah, looks like it. That's cool. I like being behind. I don't like to be ahead. It's... What, am I trying to, like, get a sub-130 or something? I don't want to be ahead. Why would I want to do that? Okay, Alright. Uh, Hopefully I can actually do this decently. And then, and then, like we... Because I did alright last time, but I definitely can do better. Really, dude? That's pretty sick. <laughs> oh, wow, it's not working! That's cool. That is not the button I pressed, you game. Alright, well, that sucks. Mm. Okay, I already exited two-player mode. That's cool. I didn't know that. It was a decent fight, other than entering that area. It was alright. Now there's no music, so have fun with that. Everyone, this is your captain speaking. Please remain calm and in your seat until the car has come to a complete crash and explode. I don't know why that makes it have no music, but it's cool. I love having no music. It's definitely not at all awkward. Oh no. chair I can sit down in. Eh, nah. I'll just keep standing. Ah, what? Okay. It's supposed to be like intense music playing right now, so it's kind of kind of weird when that's not the case.
Oh no. How did I jump too early? What? This could easily be reset if I mess something up. Which is not good. Now we got three health and that is concerning. I think there's a pizza though on the left side. Yep. Yeah, okay, good. Alright, then we're good. We're not a problem anymore. Oh, there's one little thing left. And all the weapons are dead. Alright. Can I tank all the hits? No, I cannot. I should have picked up that pizza. Oh well. We 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 Energy level two. Yeah. Ooh, I'm kind of tired. What time is it anyway? No. Later than I thought it was. That's probably good. Protect the woods. Yeah, I got a minute of time loss here. I can bring it back a little bit. Back, this will be a bear thing. Let's help him. Come on. I'm still definitely firm in the belief that sub 130 can happen, but. It sure ain't gonna be today, I'll put it that way. Eh, I need to practice fighting. It's a very hard thing to do in this game. Well, not really. It's not hard to do, it just requires timing that I'm not good at. Alright, this isn't terrible, I don't think. Alright, good. I entered it correctly. Alright, well, that sucks. And there's one little guy left somewhere. They run away, which is really annoying. Alright, hopefully I have enough candy for this. Yes, I do. Nope. Alright, well, I messed it up. Anyway. Why are you using your special, you stupid raccoon? Come back here, you stupid raccoon. Stop using your special. Oh my goodness, this is the RNG I was talking about earlier. Just doesn't know when to quit on stuff. Like that, it just doesn't know when to stop moving randomly. Very annoying. All right, finally. <laughs> 
That should not have taken as long as it did. Which is what happened last round, too. Oh well. Wasn't nearly as egregious as last time, though, so we did have some time save, but... Not as much as I would have liked, obviously. Alright, Vermtech Heist, everyone's favorite level. I keep doing that. I can't keep doing that. I can't keep using the same words again. This was probably the biggest time save. Probably the biggest time save that there ever was for a level because this used to be a 10 minute level and now it's a 2 minute level, basically. That's kind of what happened. Which, like, you can get, like, a 137, but it's... I don't wanna hurt you, what, was my, what was my best time? It's, like, a 130 or something. Not on... I never have gotten that good at a full run, but two minutes is all right. But, like I said, it used to be, like, a 11. I think my best ever doing it normally was a 13. But now it's, like, a 130, which is really cool. Please hit the button, you stupid foot. Alright. Alright, we gotta take the safe strat because I messed up the movement. save here 38 seconds so I could maybe get a 32 No, what? That was not supposed to hit. Okay, cool. Whatever. notice if you go on the inner side of a circle, you're slightly faster because it's smaller than I didn't even think of that. That's how math works. Okay. I'm not gonna mess with this. I'm just gonna try and go for it. Could, could be a new PB still though, which is cool. New PB and new world record, but I have a hard time calling them world records when I'm defeating myself. Oh, okay. I was not paying attention.
Nice! 132! It's good to see. Still not a 130, but pretty decent. <laughs> 